Ih. Well, I don't think I'm going to be going very far because that please is not good. Dynamo traffic off the Romeo final runway one nine grass Dynamo. Speed a bit of centre line. previous video because it's now that later in the day and Mark and I are now going to go for a flight and Andy Snell is off in his swift motor glider so this is what the fun's all about end of the day going for a fly okay let's get some controls right let the fun begin Okay, two wave complete. Engine temp to good. Bar neutral. What a gorgeous evening. What a gorgeous, gorgeous evening. Going for a bumble with Mark. I think we're off to Dovedale today. The air has definitely smoothed off a bit. So the last time I flew down Dovedale was actually on a lesson with Mark uh, over a year ago. It was about August last year. And... Uh, yeah, it's gonna be. I've flown past it on the way up to uh, the Lady Bar Dam and the Derwent Dam. Even though I did get them confused. If you haven't seen that video, card up here or in the description. So stick with me. Don't jump away from the video just yet. And uh, yeah, today Mark's been teaching all day, and I think it's just nice for him to just jump in something simple um, and just go and have a fly around the local area. Let's see if I can catch up with him. <laughs> it still feels odd flying like this. Probably because it makes your feet cold. Plenty of outs, even though I'm over the top of the the Dovedale ravine, I suppose you'd call it. Right, anyway, I'm going to shut the cameras down because I just want to enjoy the flight. So, I will uh, leave you to it and join you when we're uh, back over, back on our way to, uh, back to Darnley Moor. So enjoy the wing cam, everybody. Three miles to run, Darley Moors ahead, uh, rejoin checks are all done. Uh, Mark and I have had a great flight down the uh, oh, Dovedale. Where are we go, Dovedale? 
Uh, great flight down Dovedale. We're just on the rejoin now. Um, hopefully I'll have given you a few pictures of us having a, a great flight this evening. It's, uh, it's quite smooth actually. We're up only about 1,500-1,600 feet. And uh, yeah, just on, on the way back in. scenery around here. I always love coming up here to fly, just it's it's different but it's also got its own unique beauty. For those who don't realise, paragliders and paramotors are very very good wind indicators because they always have to set up into wind. <laughs> I think he's gonna have a play. He's on the descent now. Whee! I'm going to separate from him and keep clear. I've made this make mistake before of losing sight of him, but that lovely orange wing underneath is really bright on top, you can't see it. Okay, downwind checks. Fuel is on and for sufficient for a go around if required awareness marks there. And he's now clear of the active with his swift. Uh, hand throttle is closed, sorry, correction wind, we know what the wind is, we've been discussing that all the way through. Those worth steering is straight, hand throttle is closed, trim is fixed, and I am still secure. So if I'm not happy at any time, I'm going around, I'm landing on the east-west. Final, turning final, a little bit late there. How's that looking for Mark? How's that looking? Come on, Giles, a bit of speed and a bit of centre line. Coming in, we're already on the bar. I flinched earlier. That's better. Much better, Giles. Oh, temps are good, eyes are good, fuel for shutdown, and time is then. So, we'll end this video here. I had a fantastic evening flying down Dovedale. It started off with a rubbish flight this morning, and uh, so I just managed to get one circuit in. Today, it's been beautiful. It's, it's eased off, it's less gusty. Uh, a little bit of circuit practice and fun flying with Mark. So as I say, we'll wrap this video up here. I've had an absolute blast. Until next time, everybody, fly safe.